Now, the Valley's first responder on WZDX News. You'll often find a sense of brotherhood with first responders. And for one firefighter in Decatur, people say he has a huge heart for his family at home and at the station. Our Kenesha Dees tells us his name is Sean Chandler, and he's this month's Valley's first responder. At Decatur Fire Rescue, crews at station number four are known as the Rough Riders. And for Lieutenant Sean Chandler, it's been... It's kind of been a roller coaster of emotions over the 25 years. Quite a ride. Sean knew since he was a kid that saving lives was his calling. I started when I was probably six or seven years old. My mother used to carry me out to a fire department there at a plant where she worked. And those guys would dress me up and like a fireman, let me ride on the trucks. But we know with all roller coasters, they eventually stop. Chandler is hanging up his hat and his coat because he's officially retired. Whenever we get called, people are having pretty much the worst day of their life. And Sean knows what tough times feel like. His wife, Mrs. Amy Chandler, was diagnosed with triple negative breast cancer in March. And his family says now was the time to retire. Amy says Sean has a lot of grit and has always been supportive. His fire family also says his legacy at the station will remain as a mentor. Sean's the kind of guy that uh, you're, you're made better just by being around him. A way of words, he's a true mentor in every sense of the word. A pusher. First time I met him, I really thought I may have screwed up in my career choice because he was pretty hard on us. But uh, uh, as time rolled on, we figured out that he wasn't quite that hard. He was, uh, he was a good guy to work with. And a brother. When anybody in our department and in the surrounding departments have had family, personal troubles, deaths, um, tragic events happen, we've established Brothers for Life. And, um, you know, we've used Brothers for Life to help many people in this department. And Sean says he wouldn't mind taking another ride on this roller coaster. If I had it to do all over again, I would do it again. Once more. Over and over again. Putting the Valley first, Kenesha D's WZDX News. Thank you, Sean, for everything you do. Do you know someone who could be the next Valley's first responder? Nominate them. To do that, go to rocketcitynow.com and find the Valley's first responder tab at the top of the page.